How honest is Credit Karma with your credit? Credit Karma is honest. What do you mean? They they show a Vantage score though. So people try to compare their Vantage score with a FICO score. It's not a FICO score. It's a Vantage score. So it's not that it's wrong or inaccurate. It's just a different scoring algorithm. That's it. Okay, that's it. So if you're using Credit Karma, Credit Wise, Credit Sesame, Identity IQ, Smart Credit, these are these third party credit monitoring softwares. A lot of them use Vantage scores. That's why the scores are different from your like actual Experian or your My FICO or your My My Score IQ. If you guys want your, your actual FICO scores for one dollar, you want to do a seven day trial. Hit the link in my bio. Scroll to the bottom. It says get your FICO scores for one dollar. Y'all can go run that up. Seven thirty eight credit score at twenty one according to Discover. All right, that's good. That's good. But I kind of already explained that already. Uh, usually people from eighteen to twenty five. They only have one or two open accounts and their credit score looks good, but they get mad because they don't get a, get approved for the stuff they want to get approved for. You have to have actual primary accounts open to get approved for that stuff. All right. National Debt Relief been calling me. You think I should do it? I owe 15K will pay off in 48 months. No, don't do that. 15K is really not that much, bro. You, you can work your way back because National Debt Relief, what they're going to do is they're going to make you. Stop paying on your open accounts. Accounts so are going to rack up late payments. They're going to turn to charge offs. And then those charge offs turn into collections. And then that's when they go in and negotiate on your behalf. You can do that yourself. All right. The letters you send that's supposed to raise the credit should we pay off balances that's been charged off. No, if it's already charged off, you want to you want to start disputing. Yeah, you definitely want to dispute. In collection for six years, should I pay it? It's hard to get a repo off. Okay, you just said two different things. So if the repo is with the original creditor, that's why it's a lot more difficult to get removed. But it's been six years. It shouldn't even be open anymore. But now you said collection. So collections and a repo with the original creditor are two different things. Okay. So yeah, you got to figure out which one you want to attack. Even if it's both of them, you can attack both. But yeah, you just named off two different things.